congratulations on the new deal. Is it fair to say there was no real doubt in your mind that you wanted to stay here? No, there was no doubt at all. Um, after such a successful season, it was just um, just wanting to get get going again. For it's a, it's a historic season for the football club, the first one at this level um, for however many years. So it was uh, it was always something that I wanted to be part of for this season. It's a moment that you've been waiting a long time for, five years at the club, five times you tried to get out of that league and finally you did it last season. I guess there must be a lot of excitement ahead of the new challenge now. Yeah, definitely. Um, as you say, it took a long time, some couple of heartbreaks in there, uh, but it, it just made it all the, all the sweet when we finally got it over the line last season. So, yeah, as I say, we're, we're in um, entering a, a new kind of era for the club, really. Um, it's been a lot of change over the summer. Um, but we're all excited to get back and, and get going again. And the fact that that promotion didn't come easy to you, that you had to really battle and, and work hard and go through those hardships, does that make the group even stronger, do you think, going into this new challenge? I think so. I think you, you have your core group of players who have been here yeah, four or five years. Um, and I think we made the point uh, in the change room at, at the Whitby game. And um, I... I mentioned it in the huddle before the game about all the players and all the staff, the volunteers who've been here a long time, how important it was, not just for the for the team but everyone around um, the club and in the, in the community, how, how massive it was. Um, so to have all, have all them players staying again uh, as we enter this new, new um, season is massive. And of course football doesn't stand still, so there's a new set of challenges to look forward to next season. What what would you say are the main things that you're looking forward to as a player in terms of challenging yourself again at the high level? Yeah, I think it's just that excitement of a um, a new league, new teams uh, to play against, uh, new opponents, um, new grounds. It's always it's always nice to play in, in different venues. Um, and just just being back in with a group, I think... Uh, I think I missed it over the summer, just being in and around the lads. Um, so I'm excited to see everyone next week. And obviously, the new, there's, there's, we've got John on board and, and a couple of others um, due to come in. So I'm excited to, to meet them and, and get going. How confident are you that the club and, and the group, in, in terms of the, the, the players as well, are ready for this step up as well and really will, will relish this, this step up? I think that was one of the big things last se- season in terms of signings was the war, um, you know, plan for this, this level as well. Uh, so I've obviously mentioned the, the core group of players I think who've been here a while and then the lads who've added on last year. There's a real um, real bond within the group and some real quality within the squad and um, that's only going to be added too. So, you know, we're all we're all confident that we're going to uh, be really competitive this season. Of course, it's your hometown club. You get the chance to lead them out into a, into a new level, a historic level in the history of the club. I guess that must make it even more special for you. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, um, you know, I... I've mentioned it however many times how proud I am to, to lead this team and um, obviously to lift the trophy um, last season after all the effort that's been put in from everyone around the club and um, yeah it was a real honour and and I'm, I'm buzzing to be, be able to do that again this season. And when you wind the clock back five years I'm sure that when you first came in you'd be hoping that that promotion would have came earlier than, than it did. How much have you enjoyed those those five years? Oh, I, well, I think just the the love of football came back when I when I signed here. You know, I had a, a difficult couple of years, um, but just playing playing at the first cloud and and just being around the lads that we have here it was like it just brought it all back for us, all the enjoyment back. And yes, we had some disappointments, some major ones in, in playoffs, and you know even in like league games results that were hugely disappointing, but. It's all uh, it's all part of the journey. So I've absolutely loved um, the five years, and you know, as I say, it's a, it's an honour to be coming back for for a sixth season, and I'm and I'm really excited about it. And it's fair to say that in each of those five years, the club went into the into the into those seasons as favourites for, for promotion. Maybe it's not the same this time around, but do you think that might suit the group as well? That there's a little bit more pressure off. I, I don't think we'll we'll probably not pay attention uh, much attention to that. To be honest, we'll you know we'll have we'll have a good pre season. Uh, we've got some great games in there to look forward to. Um, and then we'll, we'll just give it a real good go. I think, as I, as I've mentioned about the quality in the team, there's a lot of experience in that group. Um, there's experience at this level and, and levels above, which will you know will stand us in good stead. So, yeah, I think we'll we'll be competitive and we'll we'll definitely give it a good go. And, and who knows what can happen? You mentioned earlier the changes over the summer. One of them being the manager's change to to Julio Arca. How much are you looking forward to working under him, and what have your first impressions been? Yeah, brilliant. You know, he, he got us in early. Um, 
he got a few of the boys in early to just introduce himself and, and um, find out a bit about you know the players' thoughts, which which was great, you know, to for him to, to take our advice so quickly. Um, so uh, it was it was good that he had us in and um, he has you know real ambitions for the group and has a real. Uh, you know, affinity with this football club. I, it was a year or two before I, I came in, but um, I think as soon as you as you, as you sign for the club, you realise how important a key figure he was. Um, so it's it's great to be playing under him. In pre season, it's not too far away. The first home game is going to be against Sunderland. It's the team that we played before in pre season. But how special is that game for you on a personal level as well? It's always special to play against Sunderland. Uh, having come through the uh, academy, uh, it's always nice to see old faces. They still have one or two members of staff who were there, you know, all those years ago. Um, and it's it's great for the for the club, you know, t to to bring a championship team, almost Premiership. I obviously felt the last hurdle. Um, so it'll be great to have them here and, and test yourself, test yourselves against uh, that kind of quality. Just finally, it's not too long until you're back in for the, for the train as well. It starts next Wednesday. How ready are you feeling for that and how are the next few weeks going to look? What do you say? Uh, I don't think you're ever ready for it. It's always a little bit of, a little bit of nerves before you come back. Um, but you know, we've had a good summer. A lot of the boys have been getting together um, to train. Um, so we're in, we're in good shape and we'll, we'll look forward to it and we'll only get fitter as the weeks go along. Um, in terms of what's happening over the next week or so, I'm just going to enjoy the last week off um, and then we're, we're ready to go to work.